Mm okay, is this thing on? It should be on. That's what I always say to the microphone, right? Uh, but, you know, I never know if this thing is actually on, but it, it seems to be on. We're on. This was, uh, well, this was a track that probably some of you may have seen or heard somewhere else by Hayton Music, by the way. Hello, everybody. This is going to be a stream that might end up in several different ways, but I'm basically uh, going to be playing a certain game that I should probably restart. Let's let's try and see if I can restart this thing. Maybe I won't. Uh, scary stuff. Okay, so volume levels okay. Things dropping around. Let's transition into this and let's see if it works. Here we go. Works for me. Uh, should work for you. Jeez, the backpipes are mean, right? Okay, but I hope you can hear me. Hope. Well, if you can't, that's gonna be tough. Let's go into the options, and let's go into the sound options, and let's go for the master volume. At a slightly lower level. Otherwise it's gonna be noisy as hell. Yeah. Basically, this is the first thing you always do, of course. Ah, much better now, okay. So, what's the story here? Why am I playing a game from 2007? 13 years back. Uh, this is going to be the first and probably the only shameful confession I have to make here. I never finished this game. I tried five or six different times, I guess, and for different reasons, uh, I could never just get through it. So now, you know, with the pandemic on, with streams being the, the big new thing and whatnot, hmm. And with the crisps in my mouth, which is a terrible thing to do on stream, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm, but they're yummy. I'm not gonna tell you which company, though, because they're not paying me anything. <laughs> anyway, with all this, I never got to finish, and now I'm like, hmm, how about... I'm going to follow the footsteps of the greats of the interwebs who have played similar or the same game, or similar games to this one, mm, across many years, and have streamed this, or have recorded this, or have commented... Uh, sorry, commentated on what they were, and commented as well on what they were doing and basically critiqued the not only the game but reality itself and the meaning of life uh, throughout those years. I just want to see if I can pull the same thing off while actually finishing this game because hey, guess what? The Witcher, I remember reading the books years ago in original because I happen to speak Polish, why not? Mm, and understand it quite well, still. Mm, so yeah, reading the original books was fun. Not gonna lie. And then suddenly, wham, bam! And this is the game that launched not only the, th the phenomenon or the cultural phenomenon, you know, uh, many people nowadays around the world identify uh, and, and can kind of, uh, or, or can even claim as, as, you know, something they enjoy, which is great. The more different things we can enjoy, the better for everybody. Mm, but also it launched CD Projekt. Uh, or should I say CD Projekt, <laughs> as is the Polish way of pronouncing this. But yeah, the company that is going to be releasing Cyberpunk 2077 soon, and we're gonna play this to hell and back, all of us on Twitch, and not only, I'm pretty sure. But I don't know if my computer, my old machine, is able to pull it off. So, I was like, okay, well, Cyberpunk 2077, um, sweet and whatnot, but... Let's do a retro. Let's do a let's do a 13-year-old game. Jeez, that's ages like 13 years. Where was I 13 years ago? Still in Poland, I guess. Hmm. And here we are. Mm, excuse my crisps. Anyway, mm, I won't be putting my face on the screen because why should I? Mm, that's not that interesting. And I don't have the green screen capabilities that many people out there have. Plus, my personality should shine through my voice, not through my face. Mm. Gonna be honest, I do have saves from 2015. That was the last time I actually attempted this, finishing this game. Mm. And that was really, really way back. But you know what? We're not gonna be. We're gonna be. We're gonna be going hardcore new game here. So if you've never played this game and if you want to play it on your own, warning, spoilers. Uh, you will be seeing this game and whatnot. But it's been 13 years. So I think if you wanted, if you really wanted to play this game and you had a chance, you already did it. And if you haven't yet, well, I'm sorry, just, you know, 
keep watching though, <laughs> wherever you are. Uh, okay, without further ado, uh, let's just jump into the game. And I'm gonna I'm gonna be merciless because this game has been played by so many people and has been uh, streamed and commentated on and whatnot. Like a lot of people have already been, you know, interacting with this content. I'm gonna be either silly or irreverent or in awe or whatever. But I'm basically going to be very blunt in the things I say or the things I do. I'm not gonna attempt a perfect playthrough or anything. I will be using no walkthroughs, no... no nothing. So if I get stuck at something and get frustrated, you will see it. If I suck at something, very possible, you will see it. Uh, I will try to finish the whole game. Not in one sitting, that would be quite something. But this series will basically be me playing through Witcher. And then we'll see, maybe I'm gonna do Witcher 2 and Witcher 3, because I haven't played these either. Uh, no, sorry, I played Witcher 2 a bit and Witcher 3 I have it. But I haven't played them through at all. So this is gonna be the Witcher series preparing for Cyberpunk. And not only, I mean, just basically going through this big saga that many people are enjoying. Anyway, I should shut up and play, right? Yeah, so let's hit new game and let's see. Uh, we skip the cinematic. Uh, because that would be kind of silly to start with the cinematic, although it's probably gonna run again. I don't know. Let's let's try a new game. But the cinematic, if you missed it, really well made. If I remember correctly, um, it's made by the team from Platige Image, who are some of the people behind The Witcher, the Netflix series. Um, they're involved in that. And not only, I mean, Platige Image, uh, really cool people with a really cool uh, leader. A person of, of great creativity and imagination. Uh, the name of who I will not pronounce here, just, you know, not to make your brain go, Whoa, you just use magical letters on me. So, uh, basically, look look them up. Platige Image, or P-L-A-T-I-G-E, Image. Uh, and they're really cool. I, I don't even know if I'm pr pronouncing their names correctly, like, company name. Never mind, it's not important. What's important is, like, new game. Let's press it right now, and let's see if it works. <gasps> Jeez, okay, select game mode. So, see, this is how... How well I remember this. Play the Witcher adventure through a dark world where there is no good or evil, just choices and consequences. Play one of the new adventures, each of which tells a singular story based on the world. Hmm, no, we're gonna play the whole thing. New adventures, maybe later on. By the way, this is the extended edition, or director's cut. I don't know if they cut the director with a silver sword or with a steel sword. Hehehe, <laughs> inside joke. Uh, but anyway, uh, you can get it on GOG.com for pennies, I think, at this stage. It's a very old game, so, hmm. Okay. Well. Novice gamers? I'm not a novice gamer, but I suck. But then again, let's go for intermediate. Most gamers. I'm, I'm a most gamer. Hard, I'm not that hard, and I don't like things burning behind me because then I usually get sweaty. So let's go here. Uh, most preferred featuring easy smartest metric camera, recommended casual games, one of the most strategic of you. No one can be changed at any time. So I think let's get for OTS, and of course we can change it uh, at any time. But we—I have a keyboard right in front of me, so I might be using this as well, you know. Well, anyway, by the way, I do have chat up, so if you want to chat, do chat. If you want to backseat the game, you're more than welcome to backseat the game. Uh, you know, just tell me things, shout at me—I don't know. Just don't be obscene, and do follow the channel rules, my my Twitch rules, for just being nice. Well, anyway, we're Kyer Moren in the exterior, and I'm playing this in English, even though the game is originally Polish, of course, and I could be playing it in Polish. <gasps> Shutting up! For five years after the Great War. There's always a Great War somewhere. Famine raged, the death toll unknown. Count your people, hey? A few surviving elven and dwarven units sought refuge amidst forests. Okay. Prepared for a final desperate fight. Abominable beasts ruled backwoods, highways, and former battlefields alike. In cities and villages, folk were left wondering what had happened to the witchers. Yep. The Blue Mountains in the north of Kedwin. The year 1270. Five years after the Great War. Okay. Oh, please don't tell me this is actually... Yep. This is turning into a slideshow for some of you, I think, so... I may have to dig into the settings again and spend the next five minutes setting things up. But basically we have Geralt falling over. The Witcher. The best 
start to any game is probably, you know, be on your knees, so to speak. But you're being picked up by your friends. One hopes, because they look like witchers. Could be somebody evil. Give me your uh, shirt and trousers, because you have nothing else. Maybe your gloves. Yeah, I will have to dig into the settings and make sure that this is actually not a slideshow. Jeez! I did set it up earlier, so what's going on? I have no idea. Where am I? Everything's alright. I have no idea where you've been. The important thing is you're alive and among friends. Though you look like you just left your grave. Okay, so we're gonna get through this choppy, super choppy intro, where basically, it's actually very fitting, you know, because I just nearly died. As the Witcher, of course. And this is one thing I kind of liked about this game when I started playing it the first time. You don't have to worry too much about uh, speak soon enough. We're nearing character, character creation in a way. You're, you're the Witcher, bam, you know, it's like Batman, like all the Batman games. You're Batman, you don't have to figure out the width of your eyebrows you don't have to figure out you know the size of your butt buttocks or like the depth of your voice like no you're just this character bam you're you're it and you know like it or not take it or leave it even if it's choppy geez why is it choppy i'm gonna be fixing it uh because it's perfectly fine on my screen but i can see on the obs overview that this is choppy as hell which is ridiculous because <laughs> this game is 13 years old and it should be running fine might be running into streaming issues here, I'm sorry for that. Here we are in Karen Morando. Where they have a skull at the doorstep just because they don't clean? Come on. This guy looks like one of the dwarves from, you know, that Disney movie. And this is probably a guy I don't like for some reason. We're home. Leo, get Triss. Get Triss. Triss being probably Triss Marigold, one of the sorceresses in the universe. So I'm going to be... I, I know some things. Of course, I do remember some things from the books I read years ago and from the series everybody watched on Netflix. Your time nears its end, witches. <laughs> Enjoy things while you can. Pulling glasses, evil. But why is it so choppy? Well, never mind. Maybe because it's all swords, you know? That's the choppiness here. Chop chop! Wrong! You missed the parry! I keep repeating this. Pirouette always followed by a back cross parry. Always! Barely two days have passed since they found you. Mm hmm. I owe my recovery to you. Thank you, Triss. Remember anything? Cool hair, though. Hair animation, 2007 levels. Not much. Look below. I know the moves. Pirouette, parry, cut. By the way, contrary to popular belief, this Witcher character is not voiced by Henry Cavill. Speak. A bit too early for that. Important. Geralt, we got... The birds! And then the Fire Nation attacked. Um, everything changed, right? Well, anyway. The Bird Nation attacked. This guy knows things. And looks at things. I think. And I need to think. And I'll, I'll need Time to fix this. Because this is terrible, seriously. Because I know the scene. I, I know bits and pieces of the game, of course. I played ah, enough of it to, to remember some things. Take a rest. Five what years ago. Think, is he ready for the path? But seriously, seriously. Fix this thing soon, my friend. Okay. We're gonna see in a second. This intro. Might be restarting this. No, I'm kidding. I'm not gonna be restarting this. Just, just imagine watching a slideshow. Wait and for the rest. He's alone. The professor promised fifty orange for every freak we kill. <laughs> Said the guy who looks like a freak. Uh huh. Ah oh, well, this dude is not messing around. He's alone and he can still kick your bum. Vesemir, we got company. We've got company. Slow mo running, fast mo. Ooh, that's a lot of company. Vesemir being the bows. Like a bows. I'm shutting the gate. Geralt, grab a sword off the training forms. Okay, so we'll have to pause this because this is probably a combat for tutorial reasons. I will pause the hell out of this. Okay, everybody's getting into fight. There's a training sword, fancy schmancy. 
and now let me pause the game and I'm gonna be messing around with the live view of this so apologies if, if you don't see something you will be hearing my soothing voice oh there we go you can see the the GOG screen fair enough the thing is I've been trying to get this game going and it worked quite nicely uh, but for some reason it is not working properly in the full screen mode because I don't know it just gets it gets problems and I don't know why and it's, I'm just like well come on like how many times do I have to set you up uh, it did work last time I said you know? so I'm a bit worried about this I hope I won't have to I don't know stop the stream that would be ridiculous mm, let's just try and capture this particular window uh, it did work the other time I where uh everything seems to be okay on this side of things i'm gonna add this i'm gonna add this i'm gonna pop this now let me just we're gonna go dark screen for a sec sorry for this stream people mm, now let's see if this actually picks things up uh does this even work Okay, we're in the tutorial mode, so you probably can't see anything, and this is the sad part because you can hear things, but you can't see things. What is going on here? This is ridiculous. Uh, yeah, it's grabbing the right thing. It's I don't know. We're gonna force scaling, maybe I don't know. Let's just try and force scaling. So oh, that's not gonna work. Uh, this is ridiculous because it did work last time. Please, come on. Why you not work, Witcher? It's gonna be the saddest stream in the history of streams, right? With a choppy intro and... Okay, you know what? Let me get 10 minutes into it and I'm gonna restart the moment I get it sorted. So, see you in 10 minutes and yeah, this is the saddest stream in history of streams. And I'll be back! <laughs> 